Hello there, this is Leah Mills, and today I'm going to be answering the question, are the unborn human? Now this is a very important question because basically it's, it's the pivotal question when it comes to the abortion debate. If the unborn aren't human, they're not human, there's, there's nothing wrong with abortion really. But if the unborn are human, then no justification for abortion is adequate because the unborn child in that case would be deserving of the same human rights um, under the law as you or I. So we come to this question, are the unborn human? Now, the most basic way to explain it is by going through three stages. The first is we have to establish whether or not the unborn child is alive. Now, we know that based on science that if something is growing, it's considered to be alive. So, at the moment of conception, sperm and egg cell meet, there's one cell, then as time passes, that splits into two cells, which, which splits into four cells, and then eight. So we know that based off of basic science that the unborn child is alive. Now the second stage is we also know, based off of science, that when you have a male human and a female human and they reproduce, they will have a human child. Not a new species, not a whale, dog, cat, they'll have a human child. And so biologically, science tells us that the unborn child is in fact a human. And the third stage that we have to go through is we have to establish, is human life really valuable? Now if we look at society, society has laws that inflict punishment when someone uh, murders or rapes or assaults another individual. So we know based off of secular society that there is value placed on human life. So just based on this short time span, we've established that the unborn child is alive, human, and valuable based on society, or at least they should be considered valuable. Another fact that I can throw in is that, um, first of all, the unborn child has a completely separate DNA than, the, than his or her mother. Um, at the moment of conception, there's a new DNA that's never been seen before. And also, if you look at any embryology textbook, uh, the textbook will tell you that human life begins at the moment of conception. So while the different sides of the abortion debate have debated this for a long time, science is very clear that human life begins at conception. So, are the unborn human? Yes.